everybody, welcome to Ask Mark, my scuba diving Q&A. Uh, if you have any scuba diving questions, pop it down in the comment section under the, this video and use the Ask Mark hashtag to get featured in an upcoming video. Today I'm answering a question from Maximum about twin set bolts and diving hardware. So Maximum says, hi, where do I find bolts for twin set back plates that are long enough? I need 140 mil long bolts for Xdeep's project back plate. And with my used twins, there was one 110 mil long and one 130 mil long bolt. No luck in hardware stores. Do I need to buy threaded rods and cut them? Thank you for your help. So yeah, if you're setting up twins, you're going to need some long threaded bolts which are typically m8 threads i believe i think it's like m8 and one one and a quarter or something uh i'll find out and i'll put it down here but i think it's m8 always sticks in my mind with screw threads and uh, and twins now you can find them at larger hardware stores like complete threaded rods but it's important to know that the metal that they're made from because there are several grades of stainless steel and some rust whilst some are a bit more resistant to rust uh, i mean my my twin set for example i've got a like one nut that i can only presume i've just grabbed from like my uh, my toolbox and it was clearly the wrong one because at the end of the season you can see how much it's rusted compared to the rest of the hardware on my twin sets um but yeah most divers they'll have a just a complete rod and you just grind it down to length and you actually have um like rounded caps uh screw caps that go on the ends just so it doesn't like jab and scratch into anything um you can buy them as complete sets which are usually the best way to go because then it will be made out of a, a proper marine grade stainless steel like 304 or, or 316 at the hardware store it's hard to uh, hard to guarantee i have bought some from the hardware store before and I don't know if I actually ended up using it. I think I, I think I bought it because mine, yeah, mine are like a, a touch shallow or a touch too short for um, uh, for one of my back plates or one of my wings. So I thought oh, I'll just get some new, see how it works out. Um, but then I don't think I ended up. I, I must have got my hands on some um, some actual proper um, bolts, but yeah that's typically how divers tend to do it it's just uh, be careful because there are different grades of stainless steel and most hardware tends to be m uh, actually one of my m8 by 1.25 that's actually a um like a replacement wing nut made out of um of delrin so it's, it's a little bit easier um and of course it, it can never rust and luckily for me it actually has m8 by 1.25 stamped into it so that'll be the the screw thread and the pitch um but yeah yeah it's um it's usually like hardware store but i'd rather go to like a dive center and if you search for like twinning bolts or something or if you talk to one of the uh, the crew i'm sure they'll be able to uh, to get hold of some for you <laughs>